Welcome to yet another beautiful Monday. Look at this. Holy. And welcome to my vlog. It's a freaking gorgeous day out today. Really nice day out. Can't believe how nice it is out and I gotta work it. That sucks. Oh well. We'll uh, get this day going and start off with a good breakfast and carry on. Alrighty, so I'm making a double or no not a double, just a single yellow dippy egg. Look, you can tell. There it is. My dad tech taught me to cover it. It'll require no flippage. Just let it cook. And I got some uh, bread in the toaster. So I got something to dip the dippy in. I have no idea what the rest of the day is going to bring. You know what I'm really wondering is? A while back I ordered two batteries on eBay for my uh, white and pink flip. I only got one. I sent the response in saying, where the heck's the other one? Monkey said he's sending it out. I still haven't gotten it, so I have a feeling I got scammed, son of a bitch. Ah well, anywho, I'm going to make this and eat, and I'll talk to you guys later. Well, I was so hungry that I couldn't wait. I'm already down one piece of toast and I breached the egg. And I'm watching some It's Evelyn Gonzalez on the YouTube TV. Good times. Vlogging while eating while watching vlogs. It's what I do. Anywho, I'm going to finish my egg. Talk to you guys in a bit. Well, I have no idea where the girlfriend went. She had to go pick up her mother from somewhere at 12.30. And she's not back yet. I have no idea what's going on. But, whatever. That yellow dippy egg was friggin' awesome. Friggin' awesome. I love making those. And since Daddy Tech showed me about putting the lid over the pan and letting it steam itself and then it's done. Well, that just made life a whole hell of a lot easier. Well, I'm not sure what I'm going to do for the rest of the day before I got to go into work. But I'm sure we got to find something to do. I don't know, I might just play some video games or just relax. And then head her in. Or watch more YouTubes. There's a bunch more videos to watch. Everyday Vlogger has his up and I'm going to go see what the what is with that. I just came up for a quick cigarette. I always need one after I eat. I know, I know, I know. It's a bad habit, Adam. Smarten up. But one day I will. Also for Minecraft... Um, when I used to play the 1.7 edition, there was this thing I used called single player command lines. And when they updated to 1.8, it no longer worked. Well, they finally released them for 1.8. But they're not working completely right. <laughs> there was a mode for God mode where you couldn't be hurt. And that doesn't work right anymore. You can turn off weapon damage or uh, item damage. So that your armor won't get damaged or your tools won't get broken. And you can turn on instant mining, which means one punch to a block and you're through it. But you do die still, even with God Mode turned on, so that kind of sucks. But whatever. At least uh, you can turn on invincible items and you can also turn on infinite items, which allows you to like, you know, mine one block and then turn on infinite items and just keep planting it. So for people who want to be uh, creative, going the creative way, on uh, survival mode, that's a way to do it. Uh, just turn on that mod and give her. What I'm trying to find is that uh, I was watching something called the Yoga Cast. I think that's how you pronounce it. And he had this little bar on the right hand side when he went into his equipment and he could spawn materials into his backpack. I want to find that and I also want to find another mod where this guy was sitting there and he's chopping down trees. And instead of just having to chop down every single portion of the tree like you start at the bottom and work your way up this guy was like he just hacked the bottom and the whole tree would come falling down I want that mod that would make life so much easier for clear cutting forests to build cities and stuff but I have no idea what the heck it's called I sent him a message asking him but his channel's huge so doubt he'll ever respond and uh, yeah really cool mod that I wouldn't mind getting my mitts on Anywho, I'm going to head her back inside. I probably need to change the battery on this thing. I don't know, still plenty of juice. And I'm going to head her back inside anyway. So, talk to you guys soon. Looks like Blip TV hates being rated second best to YouTube, eh? Because they've gone ahead and added the subscriptions feature. So now people can subscribe to YouTube Blip TV like they do on YouTube and get uh, videos fed to them. But it requires a Facebook account, it seems. It's kind of weird. Anywho, I made a tech video for it. I'm going to throw it up on the tech channel. A lot of you are asking, Adam, where's the Trans Am? It's right there. It's right friggin' there. Only problem is I can't drive it to work, as you all know, because of the insurance. 
and I usually don't really go cruising that often so it's kind of a waste but there are times when I'm like you know what I'm just gonna jump in the Trans Am and go and waste gas and that's pretty much all the car is good for now is wasting gas take it out burn off a half a tank just bombing around town that's what we do well the girlfriend just got home apparently she's gone to the gym with her mom so that's all right oh I'm not looking forward to work tonight but I work five days then I'm off for four so that's all right can't go wrong with that eh and then I'm officially out of floaters <clears throat> I had five floaters left I booked my last two two weeks ago which is already gone and then uh... what I shot you dude can I have your next bitch? where are you going? I'm going to your house no 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 yeah 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 oh freak sakes that little cocksucker's gonna get back in the house uh, but anyway, um, I, I shot him good, I thought. Well, I guess next time I'm going to resort to the rifle and not the pistol. But, uh, yeah, I got Monday and Tuesday off next week, so that's all right. It's another four-day weekend. Originally, I booked it off to go to Pugs, and then when I came back, I didn't have a lot of, you know, I didn't have to go right into work on day shifts. A couple days just to chill out and relax, but uh, that doesn't seem to be happening now, so, yeah. I guess I'll just have four days of sitting at home drinking beer. Good times. I, don't, I really don't know what else to do with my time until I go to work. So, um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. It's time for me to go to work. Are you going to bring me back anything like a toy or treats? No, of course not. Fine, have a good time at work, fat ass. Yeah, later to you too, tons of fun, you son of a bitch. All right, well, like I said, I got to get, get my ass into work. Uh, should I bring a coat? Frag it. Should be nice out. And I'm gonna head her in and get on with this night. All I've been playing is Google Plus games because Google Plus now has games. How cool is that? Well, probably not that cool, but uh, oh shit. Forgot my lunch. Tonight for lunch, I'm having the leftover stuffing for the peppers. It's gonna be awesome. So I'll bring that with me, and we will hit the road. Honestly, there was enough stuffing left over to fill two more peppers. I'm gonna make eight of them. But, oh well. Now we know for next time, and knowing's half the battle. Shit. Gotta quit saying that. All right, let's put her powder and get at her and get her asses into work. Oh, I'm just up for my break, and not too much going on. It's actually a real quiet night, which is good, because we're down one guy. So we got a guy called in sick, which sucks, but what can you do? And it's been a really quiet night. I think I've done one call and somebody else did one call. It's been pretty slow, so that's all right. So it's windier than all hell out here right now, which really sucks. But, oh well, what can you do, right? What can you do? Oh, I really wish I could go to Pugs this weekend, but I can't. Who's all going? Anybody on my subscriber? Anybody who subscribes to me going to Pugs? Let me know in the comments. I'd like to see who's all going and see if uh, see who's all going to be there who subscribes to me because that'd be cool but uh, yeah guys I won't be there so don't worry about it friggin sucks oh well gotta pay the bills friggin bills 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 anywho my break's almost done I'm going to head her back inside see if Pug1 has an update video on how the, the horde protection field is coming and carry on with my night so yeah good times talk to you guys later well guys it's lunchtime. I would have been out here sooner but I was taking a piss thought I had to fart turned out it wasn't a fart so now I'm out here I took it I had a pinch of grumpy so it's been a slow 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 night not too much going on Garrett text messaged me poopoo -poo Garrett yeah he text messaged me Wanted to know if we were going for coffee tonight, but then I explained to him that uh, I'm the only one in town who would be available to go for coffee. Because I do believe that um, Adrian's working tonight. Rex is out of town. Son of a bitch is in the Dominican. I do believe I'm the only one left. <laughs> so yeah, it's windier than all hell out here. I don't know how bad it's wrecking the footage, but probably pretty bad. I wish this camera had a wind cut, but it wasn't really intended to be used for filming. It's just an option that's there, right? 
It's mainly a picture camera. So I wonder who's all going to the pug birthday. That's what's really, really on my mind. Who's all going to be there? Is it just going to be the regulars or are we going to have some YouTubers there? I know I mentioned that on my 5.30 break, but it's really, really interesting to me. Bill's T-Max, you going to be there, bud? Or are you going to be out of town or what's the dice? I can assume like Ricky Sigrid and Ricky Pliance and obviously Pug. Maybe his old lady. Probably his old lady. Chances are his old lady will be there. Bam, obviously. I wonder who else is going to show. Eh, I guess we'll see, eh? So I started playing with this program called Animation Studio or Animate Studio. And it allows you to make, basically make a figure and animate it. Put a bone structure in it and control it and do like a timeline animation. And I'm just farting around with it. I don't know if I'm going to actually make anything with it. It's just animation's always been, been an interest of mine. You know, I watched this thing called ADS, ASDF Films. And the guy was basically uh, just making stick animations. And it's just like a, like a 10 second long cartoon of like, Hey, catch! Buddy throws the ball. And then you see the guy in the distance and the ball's huge and crushes him and stuff like that. And I was like, you know what, that's kind of funny. I like that. Not like I want to copy the guy or anything, but uh, it'd be cool to be able to build stuff like that. So... Yeah, just looking into it, playing around. I'd like to learn Flash, to be honest with you. I'd like to get a copy of Macromedia Flash and, and, and try, or Adobe Flash, as I should say, and try and learn how to use that program, because that could be a lot of fun. But, anywho, I'm almost done with Sagrit. I want to learn animation, but I'm going to head her back inside. So I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Well, I decided to come out early for my last break because the guy's vacuuming upstairs and he's taking friggin' Abra to do the job. So I figured I'd come up for my last break now, have my cigarette and all that. I'm going to go down here a bit to get out of the rain, out of the, rain, out of the wind. And yeah, he's just taking forever to vacuum because he's talking to one of the co-workers and oh, bloody hell. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to come up for my smoke break now. And then uh, when I'm done, hopefully he's done vacuuming. We can carry on with the night. But uh, I just got to say thanks, guys. Like, I didn't mean to go off on a rant yesterday about trolls and everything. But, uh, yeah, you guys, uh, I was expecting more comments of, uh, you know, man up and just ban them and stuff like that. But a lot of you guys were like, dude, just keep on blogging. And, you know, I like watching your stuff. And, you know, that's really greatly appreciated to hear that. Because I even got comments from people that barely ever comment. So... That's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not not about to quit. I'm not about to let one ass hat friggin' ruin my day. It's just like I said, it was that one comment that kind of bugged me, so I figured I'd talk about it, like selling your life. Come on, guys. Like, really? <laughs> selling my life would be if I, like, you know, Pepsi said, hey, if you uh, show our products in your videos, we'll give you friggin' Pepsi products and money, and, you know, that's, that's selling yourself. But I just talked to a camera in friggin' public, you know? be different if Canon sent me this camera and said, hey, if you use our camera and mention it 25 times in your vlog, we'll send you free uh, free gear. Yeah, that'd be kind of rude. But I use this camera because it's neat. You know, the only thing I don't like about it is the fact that the wind just deckers the video. Personally, that's what I liked about the flip, was the flip had a lot less, uh, well, it was a lot more tolerant in the wind, I found. And I really like my Panasonic, but it's a real bitch to carry that thing around to vlog with. It's a lot heavier than this camera, that's for sure. So yeah, just out for my smoke break. Gonna go for a quick little strut. I don't think anything's going on tonight after work. I think we're uh, just gonna head her home and call it a night. Maybe go home and have a beer. I think I still have some left. Like one or two. Yeah, I drank six beer last night. Good times. Something that I didn't get on camera, cause sure enough I decided I'm gonna end the vlog. Cause nothing's going on cause Cat Piss never got back to me or anything. Sure enough, I end the vlog, edit it, render it pitch it up on the netbook to upload it because that's what I do I have the netbook for uploading and start the upload and my phone goes off friggin cat piss hey dude I feel really bad about last night you know I kind of passed out on you which I told you guys he did right and uh, let's go for coffee so we went for coffee and that was off the vlog and we just chatted and caught up on stuff and the audio is probably getting dickered by the wind right now so yeah, we just hung out and chatted. I didn't bother getting that on video. Went for uh, a cruise. I didn't drive because I was hammered. He drove. Yeah, I'm surprised. We didn't see... Well, we saw some wildlife leaving the house because uh, there's a family of deer. I've shown them a couple times on video. Family of deer. But the route we took, we went down towards Temiskaming. And then uh, when we came back, we went up uh, the old back roads up to Tower Drive and sure enough no deer none hit my road deer little bastards coming into town because they know it's hunting season 
And here comes that wind. Oh, freak sakes. Should have stayed over by the building. So we went out for a cruise and I even talked to him about what was said in the previous video. And he's like, ah, forget it, man. Who cares? He goes, who do you think gets trolled more? He goes, I get trolled in my RC videos all the time. And it's, I'm like, well, yeah, you got a point. He still makes them, you know, when he can. Now that he's back in school, it's kind of rough, but. Oh, what can you do, right? Not sure what else to talk about, except for thanks, guys. Thanks for the support. I greatly appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, friggin' love having people out there who, uh, actually enjoy watching what I put out. I know my life isn't the most exciting thing in the world, but, uh, I try. I try to make the videos entertaining enough, and, uh, I'm glad a lot of you enjoy watching them. So as long as you guys keep watching them, I'll keep making them. And, uh, I'm gonna head her back inside, and I'll talk to you guys later. Work's done. Time to go home. All right, well, let's pit her patter and get at her, and I guess I'll do a time-lapse drive of the drive home because I haven't done one of those in a while, so let's do this. How's that for record time making it home after work, eh? Okay? Yeah! Friggin' just hammered down, put the car in GT mode, and shift it through the gears. It does actually feel a lot faster when you shift it manually than letting the car shift itself just in drive. I think it like locks the torque converter or some shit. And it just, uh, well, it has, this is a lot more friggin' powerful, that's for sure. You yeah, know, it's a pretty epic time. Normally it takes me 10 minutes to get home. No, I wasn't speeding. Honest. <laughs> well, I'm gonna pretty much end the vlog here, guys. It's about... I don't know, some, sometime after midnight. I haven't looked at the time yet, but I know I got home in epic time because uh, I didn't even finish my smoke. So, good times. Well, I'm going to uh, end it here. So if you like today's video, you know what to do. Go ahead and hit the like button. Because you know me, I like it when you hit the like button. Let me know you like the video and I like that. Yeah! And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns about today's video, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section below. And I'll be sure to respond like I always do. And until next time, guys, keep on vlogging.